Today we're going to explore the southern part of Bali together and I'm going to show you the best beaches, some of the best food in the world and the best pamper spots to check out. So before we head to Chenggu, we're going to do this walk. What's your vibe? Walking. Yeah, it's like, can we put the cameras away? There are like butterflies everywhere. Y'all don't want to see how much I'm sweating right now. I'm literally freaking dripping. I just need water. Kapuhan block is worth it. It's a good workout to burn off all the amazing food we're gonna eat tonight. So I'm happy. Can is running away because of a wasp already. And the wasps here are ginormous. So she said we have to go. She's on the move. This is why I'm sweating because this girl's scared and she's running. Okay, so my dad's obsessed with watching Bali YouTube videos. So we are going to this restaurant to try authentic local food and the Trabu Minang restaurant. My dad's already sitting. Are you excited? Are you excited? Very much. This food great for me. I love it. I'm gonna cry. So hungry. <laughs> Dad, I'm the one that hasn't eaten. You have to eat here. Try, you know. <laughs> if you're gonna go to it, you know, you have to do things. You know. What is this? Potato. Potato. This one? Fried chicken. What fried is fried. this? Just a lemon. Liver we don't want. Okay. Fish. fish. So dad, what do you think? Very good. Come on, be honest. Honestly, it's okay. Is it good? Or is it good? Eight. eight. You're saying eight out of ten? No way. Be honest. I'm eating deep fried crumbs with rice. See, the flavors are good, but it's just I don't like that it's cold. So the restaurant was a no from me and my family. It was not good at all. It was cold. But now we're at BCI Hair and Beauty Supplier and we're gonna get some stuff for like gel nails and stuff. So I'm really excited to be here. Bye. 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 Thank you. Bye. Get it. Bye. Guys, this is our villa. How beautiful is this? gonna talk about outside and the TV on the roof but I just have to show you guys we don't even need adapters here it's a small thing but it makes a difference a little outfit of the day honestly not really my favorite but we'll make do and honestly I think it's just my skin that's turning me on I mean turning me off not on don't walk in Kangoo just get a grab there is no sidewalk Good morning guys, it is officially our second day in Changu. I'm just sitting here chilling, camera's fogging up because of the condensation. Just sitting here enjoying some food by the pool. What a better view, I can't imagine. My bathroom is already a mess, but today we're going to Potato Head Beach Club with my family and I don't know what to wear. I bought this crochet bikini, so I think I'm gonna wear that. I didn't know what to do with my hair. I didn't know what to do with my makeup because I didn't want to wear makeup because obviously I'm going to the beach, but it's like my acne is so bad I have to. I really enjoyed showering and our outdoor shower today was so nice and if I wasn't breaking out so bad. I would make so many get ready with me like skincare videos in this bathroom. So it's really a shame. Maybe I'll still do it. Even like this wall is such a good wall for photos. Like there's just a photo opportunity at every corner in this villa and in Bali in general. If you do content, Bali is the place for you for sure. We're at porn cakes. Oh wow, thank you. 
Yeah. What happened? I don't, we don't have to wait 30 minutes for that. Oh, I thought it's free. Okay, so we're finally at the brunch club, Bali, and this is where they have corn cakes, the famous corn cakes. I have never tried souffle pancakes, so I'm super excited. We got the New York cheesecake and the Benafi pie. We also got the big brunch, so. Pineapple mint juice. Can I got watermelon? Let's give the pineapple mint juice a try. Um, kind of wish there was more mint, but it's still really, really good. But maybe share because it it gets really heavy really quick. And now we're bloated for the beach, so yeah, Canada's dead. So the UV is extreme. We forgot sunscreen, so we're screwed. I'm literally already dripping sweat. But we're at Potato Head now and just even the entrance is so cool. It's like so luxurious and beautiful. So I can't wait to see what's inside. We are here. This is our little day bed. There is a hundred fifty million dollar minimum here. So you have to be ready to spend hundred fifty dollars on food, drinks, whatever you want. Shanna. <laughs> what do you think? Be a little enthusiastic. <laughs> We've just been chilling. I have my coconut. Bathing yeah. suit is from Shein. We took some pictures. And honestly, we're just chilling for the day. I'll check in with you guys when it gets dark and the sunset's about to come. But besides that, I'll be chilling in the sun. videos he's been watching on YouTube so it looks great the surfboards are ready we're just here so I'll check in with you guys later yeah I don't really like you but I try to so I can't have fun I just roll around town with a frown on the run I don't really like you but I try to so I okay we just surf for one hour my face is like swollen and sensitive from the salt water but it was really good me and Hannah both stood up. We stood up, both of us, and we fully served. For once, because last time it felt so hard to serve, but this time, for some reason, the instructions just seemed so easy. So, Kiana got bit by a jellyfish, unfortunately. Does it hurt? Someone needs to pee on her. Me and Kiana just finished surfing. Kiana got stung by a jellyfish. My eyes are burning for some reason because of the salt water. But we're at Jimbaron now and we're gonna eat some seafood. We got the seafood package. So we got lobster, fish, calamari, crab, prawns, and everything. I can hardly open my eyes right now for some reason. Watermelon juice as usual. I give you four sauce. You should sauce, garlic, balini sauce, spicy, tomato, little spicy, yeah? This is sauce for calamari okay. sauce, yeah? So we have crab here, calamari, lobster, white snapper, and then prawns. Baby kitties! I love that baby <laughs> kitty! I have a spicy sauce. <laughs> Oh my god, it was really spicy. I like the calamari a lot. 
It was so good, but I'm literally sweating so much because it was so spicy. I haven't sweat like this like, ever, actually. <laughs> Kiana, what did you think? It was good, really good. I really wanted butter. I feel like I like lobster with butter, less like barbecue lobster. But my favorite was the calamari, to be honest, which is kind of random. Another day, another beach club. Today we're going to Sunday's Beach Club. I've never really heard of it. I just searched it on Google and it looked cute. So we're like, why the hell not? Let's just go there. Yesterday after we came back from Gymbron, we just went to massages at this place called Spring. It was really, really nice. Not quite as good as Jane Spa. I really recommend Jane Spa. But if you're in the Chenggu area, this is a lot closer. You can't even go to Jane Spa. It's an hour and a half away. So this was a really close second. So yeah, I would recommend it. Especially my sister really liked her pedicure. We're going to go eat breakfast and then we're gonna head to Sunday's Beach Club, so I'll see you guys there. We're weirdly soul tied over here. He's talking about animals. Going to Sunday? Okay, good, thank you. Our staff will arrange your bin get down there. Thank you. Hi. Hi. Sure, thank you. We currently have the bin bag for now. We have the water sport also. They already include with your day pass. Perfect. That will be start at around one o'clock. Okay. Uh, snorkeling, paddleboard, and kayaking. Okay. okay. Sunday Beach Club and we're at the Christmas market. It apparently it has like handmade goods and stuff and you don't have to barter here so it's pretty good. Let's just see what they even have. It's nice. Maybe I should start a van. A Bali tote bag, anyone? Honestly, kind of cute. Cute little picnic basket. A little Bali wallet. So this is $3.50. Honestly, some of these are actually really cute. You always need a little pouch for something. What is this supposed to be? Let's see what bracelets they have. These are kind of cool. $1, why not? Let's see what Circle K has in Bali. They have milk outside the fridge here, I noticed. Tiramisu, seaweed, a little small baby water. Lucky, this is 90 cents. I'm definitely getting this. How are you doing right now? I don't know what's happening here. There's a couple eggs. This is our third beach club, I guess. 
and this one's very like a pizza, very pretty. The beef is so clean. It's quite expensive, but it was like an hour and a half away from Kangoo, so it was a little bit far. Bikini I bought here for five dollars, and I'm excited to take this later. So our day slowly started to fall apart when we realized there were murky things in the water and the beach wasn't that nice at that beach club and it was really expensive like $8.50 for a bottle of water is absolutely ridiculous and now we have ended up at a local supermarket originally trying to find a new suitcase because we have too much stuff and we need another luggage to take home but after this we're gonna go to a traditional market and try to find one it's just really difficult to find one for some reason we've been on the hunt for a couple days gotta buy some souvenirs still i don't know let's see if we can revive this day they have literally thousands of necklaces in this store they have these little cute chokers too we're at the kuta art markets so they have a bunch of this stuff here it just goes on forever the thing in Changu is that a place can be five minutes away, but take 13 minutes because it's a one way road. We're back at Potato Head today. It's just me and Kiana. No one wanted to come to the beach with us. But we only have two days left, so that means only two days of tanning, and I'm definitely not of the color I want to be, so there's a baby in the DJ booth. We came to Echo Beach to watch the sunset and we decided to get some corn first. Corn was so good and just hit the spot. There were a lot of people surfing and a lot of dogs everywhere. They were so cute. And then we ended up going to this really, really good restaurant. I'll put the name on the screen because I totally forget what this was called, but it was bomb. And then the next day we decided to head back to Finn's Beach Club for the day and just relax for our last day in Bali. We just relaxed a bit and then I decided to go surfing because I talked to those surf instructors the night before, but let me tell you, it was not a good idea. Guys, ignore my skin. Ignore me right now. I feel like I just literally got beat up by the freaking waves. I'm just casually covering my acne. I think I'm going on Accutane after this trip, by the way. So if you want to see that journey, let me know. But anyways, back to my point. I just went surfing for my second time, but this time was so different. I literally got beat up by the wave. There were like seven waves in a row that I had to throw my board and dive under and I felt like my foot was literally gonna get pulled off. I ended up getting a bunch of like injuries and scratches like this and it's just not okay. After the seven consecutive waves, he was like, get on your board and ride the wave. And it was like so scary. I knew I was already so tired. So I just like couldn't even get myself to get up. So by the time I got the energy to get up, I was like, nah, and I let go. And I started riding the board. And then I started getting scared because like the waves just don't stop here. It's going and going and going. And then my board flipped. And then I was sitting on the fins. And then the fins just kind of like hit my leg like that a couple of times. And that's how this came about it's also on my butt but i'm not going to show you guys that um because inappropriate and then my dad was like on the beach taking pictures of me and he got so worried he's like get back over here like i literally thought you died like you went under the water and never came up because literally i was gonna drown 
like if it was anybody else they would think like they were about to pass away in the waves like it was just it was just crazy i mean the instructor was nice and everything but i thought i was ready for big waves definitely not oh and my sushi's here thank you We had the most delicious honey elderflower toast. It was so good. All the food is amazing. And then we went to this handmade pasta restaurant. And again, bomb, just like every other piece of food I've eaten in Bali. It's just really, really good for food, I'm telling you guys. Then we had to do one last stop at a fruit market because my dad still wanted to go to one. And we ended up trying durian. I've tried it once before, but I kind of forgot what it was like. So we decided to try it again. It was not in season though. So we weren't really sure if we were getting in the full experience, but we still tried it. I don't know what I think. Oh. Is it good? Mm. This one is ready? Yeah. Yeah. What is it? Ta tofu. tofu. Yeah. And that is officially it for our trip to Bali. Bye. Thank you. <laughs>